Well, Bishop Joanne, welcome to our Organising for Growth Local Action Teams meeting. It's so good to have you with us for a little while, and uh, this is really uh, the highlight of our evenings, I'm sure, and uh, we're delighted that you can join us for this little commissioning. Uh, in community organising, we like to do a rounds. Um, it's to introduce ourselves, and a really important part of that is to, to recognise each other and to be recognised. And so what we're going to do is we're going to, so most of us have managed to prepare a sign to introduce ourselves, what team uh, we're part of and how we're feeling. And I think Sarah's going to take an image. Now, Jessica has a Bible reading for us. So Jeremiah 29, verses 4 to 7. This is what the Lord Almighty, the God of Israel, says to all those I carried into exile from Jerusalem to Babylon. Build houses and settle down. Plant gardens and eat what they produce. Marry and have sons and daughters. Find wives for your sons and give your daughters in marriage so that they too may have sons and daughters. Increase in number there. Do not decrease. Also, seek the peace and prosperity of the city to which I have carried you into exile. Pray to the Lord for it, because if it prospers, you too will prosper. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks to God. God. Me to God. Thank you, Jessica. Now I'm going to hand over to Bishop Joanne, who's going to lead us in our commissioning. Thank you. Um, I also just want to do, just before we get to that, just to reflect a little bit on those words from Jeremiah. I was so pleased this was um, in the service this evening. It's one of the most inspiring passages for me when I think about why Christians ought to be out there in the community, why we, you know, we have a foot in the public square. Um, and I think really it's because at the heart of it, it's saying something about seeking the peace and prosperity of the city. And that's a really broad and inclusive call to work with everybody who is a person of peace for the good of everybody. So it's not about a club that you can join and will help each other, you know, do better in the world. This is something that's there for everybody and that we serve. Um, so in particular, that, that we're being asked really to grow as a Christian community in, in depth by putting down um, roots and, you know, planting things and eating things um, in impact through our influence and through the connections we make. And, you know, number, it's talking about increasing. Um, we need to grow as Christian communities, as, as churches in Stephanie area. We need to care for our community and we need to grow as, as individual disciples becoming more and more um, connected between our faith and, and how we, we live that out. And so um, I'm just so excited to, to see this all developing and the work that you're doing together. I really believe that, that organising for growth is at the heart of what we do um, together as churches um, and as disciples. And so I just want to say, you know, be blessed. When, when the city prospers, then um, you prosper too. And, and we all seek God's peace together. So please be blessed and be encouraged in what you're doing. Now, I'm going to ask different, um, different ones of you. I think you know who you are and who's got to answer. So I'm going to ask the question and I hope you'll reply loudly and confidently with the help of God, we will. To the co-chairs, will you work together to identify, develop and deploy the gifts of leadership along with the vision and vocations that the Lord has established amongst the members of your teams? With the help of God, of God we, will. we will. To local action team members, will you dedicate yourselves to the work of cultivating growth in outreach, engagement and depth amongst the church family at St John's Hoxton and in the wider neighbourhood? With the help, With the help of the people, we will. We will. We will. The Organising for Growth project team, will you resolve to support the development of this project through patient listening, careful discernment and wise management of the gifts and skills of those serving on the local action teams? With the help of God, we will. We will. And to everyone, will you all seek the peace, welfare and flourishing of all people, Christians and otherwise, in this Hoxton neighbourhood in which the Lord has placed you? With the help of the Lord, we will. We will. Well done. <laughs> the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you today and always. Amen. 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 Amen.